Imagine a world where gods are not just mythical figures, but real guardians of health and healing. In the vast and mysterious land of Dobrigia, crisscrossed by rivers and dotted with ancient ruins, a lesser-known deity makes his presence felt. His name is Darzalas, a name that may not resonate with the same force as Zeus or Apollo, but in the hearts of those in Dobrigia, it echoes deeply. This episode is dedicated to Darzalas, the Dacian god possibly associated with health and healing, worshipped with a devotion that spans millennia. Darzalas, also known as Darzalus, is an enigmatic deity revealed to us through ancient inscriptions found in Dobrigia. Although written sources about this god are scarce, each artifact and inscription unearthed helps us piece together an ancient puzzle. Darzalas was not a major god in the Dacian pantheon, but his significance for health and healing made him essential in the lives of those who worshipped him. What makes Darzalas so special? Unlike other deities who controlled natural phenomena or human destinies, Darzalas was closely linked to the physical and spiritual health of his followers. Sanctuaries dedicated to Darzalas were refuges where the sick came seeking relief and where miracles of healing could occur under his benevolent gaze. Darzalas's influence was not limited to acts of healing. This god was a symbol of a rich and complex culture. The Dacians, known for their bravery in battle, also had a deeply spiritual side. The worship of Darzalas shows a less known facet of this people, that of a society that placed great value on the health and well-being of the community. Archaeologists digging in the lands of Dobrigia often uncover more questions than answers. Each artifact linked to Darzalas is a window into the past but also an invitation to speculate. What did the worship ritual look like? What exact role did Darzalas play in the daily life of the Dacians? We attempt to reconstruct these aspects using modern technology and interdisciplinary studies. Behind every deity lies a story. The legends about Darzalas, however fragmented, are laden with symbolism and wisdom. Stories of miraculous healings and divine appearances offer us a perspective on how people imagine divine intervention in their world. In a modern world, where technology and science provide answers to many of our questions, is there still a place for Darzalas? We find that in contemporary culture, old beliefs can take on new interpretations. Festivals, books, art, and digital media rediscover and reinterpret the figure of this ancient god, connecting the past with the present in creative and surprising ways. As the sun sets over the ruins of Dobrigia, the last light bathes the silhouettes of ancient temples in gold. Darzalas, the god of health and healing, may no longer receive daily prayers as he once did, but his legacy continues to inspire and provide hope. In every stone, in every rediscovered story, Darzalas lives on, an eternal symbol of our quest to understand the mystery of life and healing. In Dobrigia, under the vast sky, the Dacian god reminds us that even in an era dominated by science, magic and mystery are never truly far from us. In conclusion, let us remember that every discovery is a bridge between past and future, and each step on this bridge is a journey not just through time, but also through the infinity of our humanity. In a mysterious chamber, deep within the ancient archives of the Library Channel, the Grand Council of the Elders gathers. Under the flickering candlelight, they've concocted a plan to appease the capricious YouTube algorithm gods. Their offering? A chicken, unsuspecting, clucking away, about to be sacrificed on the altar of virality. 
But fear not, dear viewers, for you hold the power to save this feathered friend. How, you ask? Simply by hitting the like button, subscribing to our channel, and smashing that bell icon with the fervor of a hero in an epic saga. Together, we can spare the chicken and ensure our videos soar to the heights of YouTube glory. Join us in this noble quest, and may the algorithms forever be in our favor.